Hey guys, how's it going? It's F50 Gaming here, and for part 14 of Drive Club All Cars, we'll be driving the Chevrolet Corvette Stingray C7, and look at it. That just looks too cool. It's quite a cheap car. I think it's only like 60 grand in the States, which is pretty cheap. <laughs> 60 grand for a Corvette. It's crazy. It's got 450 horsepower. It's got a V8, obviously. I don't, I don't know the exact size. I think it's like a five-liter. Might be even a bit bigger than that. But yeah, this car's pretty quick. Yeah, uh, I think it could get. I think its top speed's like around about 185. It's got quite a lot of torque. It looks really, really cool. And yep, let's take this thing for a spin. Just look at that. Mmm. Mmm. Looks good. Does look good. So how's everyone's day going? <laughs> oh, listen to that. Nice, right, cool. When it upshift, it makes like a little crackle. You can't really hear it from the inside of the car, but outside of the car, it's very um, now this car is quite tail happy, obviously because it's rear wheel drive, like every single American muscle car. But it does have a pretty good amount of grip due to the fact that it's got a big V8 strapped to the front. And it is rear wheel drive, it does pretty good. And yep, it's a Corvette. Not much more to be said about it. <laughs> oh, I don't know why I went off there, it's a bit Alright, now I might, have, yeah, I'll have to lift off there for a bit. As you can see, the speedo is very easy to read, so if you want to find out your speed, you don't need to go outside of the car. And, ooh, dang. The corner's a very good corner to go around this car. As you can see, the graphics in this game is amazing. I have to say, probably better than Forza Horizon 2, in my personal opinion. People want to diss me in the comments, go screw yourself, that's just my personal opinion. Because I will have nothing said about this game. One thing I hate about this game, the online servers. The online servers are really, they're shit. They are really shit. I always do single player though. I do tour events and I just unlock cars and stuff. But yeah, it's gotten me pretty frustrated to the point where I actually broke the case for the game. Yeah, there was a stupid online race, and what happened is that it was really glitching out, and one minute I was first, and two seconds later I was last, and they were like two miles ahead of me, and I was just like, this is horse shit, I kind of chucked my case, didn't mean to break it, I kind of just meant to just, yeah, and yeah, it kind of broke it, but hey, gotta let you angry out one way or another, eh? But you know what? <laughs> It's not fully broken, it's just kind of like a little, little hole in the bottom. That's okay. Well, let's get back to the car, shall we? This car is quick, <laughs> I'm just saying. This car is really quick, and it looks damn good. And it did a 247? Two, did it? 247, I think it said. 242. Why did it? Why did I think I said so? But yeah, 242. That is a damn quick time. I think that's. I think that's just as fast as like some SLSs and stuff. Maybe a bit faster, which is pretty impressive. But yeah, that's part 14, guys. I hope you liked it. I upload one of these videos every day, and if not every second day, and make sure you check out my other vids. Please like, subscribe. It means a lot. And thank you, guys. Have a good day.